fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 21st of December 2022 and we, lucky Sudokans, have been given a small Christmas present uh, from Julian, our big supporter on the channel here, our uh, regular viewer and commenter. Thank you, Julian. We really appreciate all of the comments that you made over the last however long you've been making them, which is a long time now, uh, maybe uh, a year or so, something like that. So uh, thank you very much. And he has, Julian has kindly supplied us with a game to play. Uh, I think he said it was an easy level game, but who knows, because he is actually a, one of our hottest players. And so what he defines as easy might not be easy for the rest of us. Uh, <laughs> so we shall dip into it and see how it turns out, shall we, um, fellow Sudokans? And uh, if you'd like to say thank you to Julian, you can on the uh, in the comments section. We do appreciate it. Right. So uh, I can see some nice ones, threes and fours. I think we're going to start with this nice little stuff in the middle here because I like the ones across like this. And that's going to give me a one here. And I like the threes across this way, which is going to give me nice threes. They're nice, nice patterns looking there. And the fours down here like this. Nice. Isn't that nice? Kind of... Uh, um, kind of symmetry and perpendicularism, if there is such a word, <laughs> in one go there. There aren't any more, are there? The ones, threes, and fours, but they're looking nice anyway. Uh, well, actually, what we've got now is nines blocking across here like this, which is going to put nines back into these three squares, back across here, and the nine up here. So that is going to give us a nine like so. Uh, I wonder what else is going on in this puzzle. Uh, we've got seven coming down here like this, and seven across these two rows here. So that gives us a seven in that square there. Um, hmm. Okay. So that's a nice start, isn't it? Uh, let's see what else is, if anything else is on offer that's fairly straightforward, or if we have to start thinking, putting our thinking caps on already. Uh, let's see further well we have six across there six there okay we have sixes across this row with a six down and a six up that's going to give us a six in this square here well it's going to put sixes down here like this uh, what else is going on in this middle this middle keeps attracting me but actually maybe I shouldn't be looking there maybe I should be looking s elsewhere um, but it is it is it draws my eye, you know. <laughs> I'm not sure if that was intended, but it certainly is working. If that was the intention, it's pulling my eye in towards the center. I feel like I'm being dragged in like a black hole or something. Uh, what do we have? We have missing numbers. We have the sixes here. We have two, five, six, and seven missing, and we have sevens in these squares, and we have sixes like this. And so that's going to be a 2-5. Um, let's see what else. Uh, there must be uh, other things we can do. Um, let's, i tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to start investigating by going through the digits and seeing what's available. So we get ones possible in those squares there on that row, if that means anything. Okay, uh, let's see what's going on with the twos now. Don't see too much. Can we get any more threes? Not so sure. Fours are going to be in these squares here and those squares up there, and those squares up there, and down here we've got four like this. So again, we've got some symmetry, which is not particularly great for Sudoku, uh, for, t for moving ahead in Sudoku. Um, 
so for the sevens we definitely have seven across here like this we have sevens here and sevens here unfortunately we've got this little three possibilities here uh what do we know about eight eight blocks across here so we've got ourselves eight in these squares like this and eight blocking down here so we have eight in those squares there so we had sixes here and we had eights here um, do we know anything else am i missing something else yes we've got eights up there and we've got eights i guess somewhere down here All right, we're desperately hoping that the nine is going to give us a bit more. And it doesn't, so I guess this is definitely a thinking caps on kind of game. Uh, five. Right, so uh, we've come this far. We've done the easy stuff, and now it's time to start uh, working harder uh, just looking down here we've got six two six and two across there but four and seven is no good because we've already got the four uh, and seven down here which means there are three squares but the six and two uh, are not enough to deal with that Four, seven, two. Okay. So I don't know if I work this out, but four, seven, two, five. Four, seven, two, five are not in here. That's four numbers, and they block these squares here. So four, seven, two, and five must be in these squares here, right? So if this is four, seven, two, and five, the missing numbers here. Four, seven, two, five. I've got to work it out. <laughs> Hang on a second. Four, seven, two, five. I've got to keep saying it in my head because I'm going to forget. Uh, we are left with eight and nine right am i right eight and nine here so we've got four seven two five six one three yeah eight nine so the nine blocks across here so that will be the nine and that will be the eight okay um now we had sixes here didn't we and we've got sevens like that. i'm not sure let's see about this sevens in those squares these squares i mean uh, and no, so we still had sevens up like that. Right, uh, what else is going on in this block? Um, so we have fours across like this. The twos we don't know. The fours are here. The sevens are here. Two, four, seven, five. What do we know about five? Nothing. Oh, I can hear a cat. Hold on a second. I just got to check on my cat. Okay, we have uh, a cat joining us, so if you hear any meowing, uh, it's not me, I promise. Um, now I've lost my train of thought again, Sudokus interrupt us again. Oh, oh dear, cat, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, Johnny, sit there, oh dear, this is not good, the cat, uh, ugh. <laughs> it's really great that you can't see uh, that you can't s that there is no camera for this it's really good that there is no camera for this um, because the cat um, my cat is uh, sick as you've heard me talk say on this channel many times I have a permanently sick cat and he's demonstrating that he's not particularly well at the moment so oh dear all right God, let's get back to the Sudoku if I can, if I may. I've totally f lost my thread now. That's really... Um, 
what am I going to do with this cat? I really don't know. Uh, lost it. Totally lost my concentration. What's going on at the ends of these, at the ends of the earth, I was about to say. We're looking for one and we're looking for three, I guess, at the ends. Um, Johnny. Come on, you want to go outside? Excuse the constant interruptions today, the Sudokans, and it's a uh, uh, that's annoying, especially because this game is a gift to us. Don't like to spoil our presence, do we? But uh, unfortunately, uh, life gets in the way sometimes. Right, let's get on. Uh, one, three, nine. Okay, one, three, nine. Blocking up here. Oh no. One nine. I thought I'd seen one three nine in those squares there, but that's not to be. But I do have one nine, but the three I was mistaken. Not to be true. But I have one and nine somewhere up there. Um so that's not enough info just yet. I can see seven and four here and here. So I know 7 and 4 are up in that row there. Again, I've only got the 7 blocking the 4 I don't know about at this stage in the game. Um, we do know that 4s appear in those squares there. Hmm. And up there. And the sevens are here, four, seven, eight, eights are there. Hmm. Ah, four, six, oh no, 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 we've got four here, I was about to say four, six, two in those squares, but I would not have been correct. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, I'm desperately looking, for, desperately seeking tri triples, you know, that wasn't there an album Desperately Seeking Susan or something like that in the 1980s? Desperately Seeking Triples, I am right now, six, seven, seven, two, five, seven, two, five. Seven, two, and five blocking down here. Yeah. Okay, seven, two, and five block here. That means that these three squares contain seven, two, and five. Right. So, seven, two, and five. So, these squares contain eight and something. Seven, two, five, eight. Well, the eight blocks here, right? So, I know that that's the eight. Let's do it like that. And then seven, two, five are here. This has to be four. Finally, I can get there. Okay, we've got fours blocking up like so and across these two rows here. That will give me a four in that square there. Uh, I'm enjoying this game, Julian. Really nice. Uh, and I can see why you are a notation. Uh, Julian, uh, for those who don't read the comments, Julian is one of our notation-free experts and enjoys playing the game in that way and uh, so is likely to design a puzzle that would be would, that would work well in a notation-free uh, way, I'm guessing. Uh, right, let's see what else we have to do. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, this is not that easy, I reckon. Hopefully you will have clicked and played the game before playing this, so you will know. Ah, of course, 7 now, of course, as I said earlier, seven's blocking across like this. I did mention that before, didn't I? The 7 and the 4 in the top row there. So yes, indeed, 7 there. So 7 down here, here's the 7 now then. And didn't I have 7s in these two squares? I did. Look, 7 down, 7 up. And now we've got 7 across, so yes indeed, 7 goes there. Now I can see that 7 and 4 block across here, so this is 7 and 4. We've got 7 blocking here, so that's the 7 and that's the 4. 4 down here, 4 across, or if I can keep my finger on the right key, I'll be doing better. 4 will go in there, that's 4 and 7, both complete, yee And we can get this digit here, all we have to do is work out the missing numbers here, which are 5 and 2. I believe and so this is not five or two and therefore must be a six six down here six across here that puts a six into that square there we're gonna have sixes up here um, but down here and then still a group of four up there so can't quite finish off the sixes yet Let's see what else we can do. We are missing 2-5 here. This is 2-5 as well, of course, because that has to match, doesn't it? So 2-5 like this. Um, hmm. Ah, seeing the 2 block across here, we know that 2 is in one of those squares. Does that help us anyway? No, I don't think it does. Oh, it, oh no. Mm. Eight, six, yes, okay. So here we go, ladies and gentle folk. We have uh, eight, eight blocking here. So we have eight in this column here. Do you agree? Blocking up here like this, eight blocking up here and eight blocking across. Then we have the six blocking across here and the six blocking up here and the six blocking up here. So we have, in fact, a pair of 6 and 8 in these two squares. We will then be looking for... Oh, these, <laughs> these squares, these, <laughs> these goddamn numbers again, 2 and 5, right? Ah, so that's going to help us, right? Okay, so then this, if this was 2 and, f this was two and 5, wasn't it? So this is 2 and 5, so this will have to be 2 or 5 in these two squares because we already worked out this is six or eight so clearly this can't be five so that must be our two our five will be here our two will be here our five will be here and our two will go there ta-da oh i enjoyed that thank you um right still stuff to be done though i'm not celebrating yet by any means still we still are not there yet. When I say we, I mean me. You might have got it already, but I'm still fighting here. I wonder if now is a good time to click on the digits and see if I can spot any patterns that will help me. I did indeed. How about that? So that we have a one blocking down here and one across here. That means one is in one of these two squares blocking across here. The the one down. So that has to be a one there. And now we can say one blocking up here and up here, and that will be our digit one. And so this cannot be one. And I know that we needed one and three at the ends of these column. This column because I worked it out before. So clearly the one must be down here, and the three must be up there. One number missing down here, I think it's a nine. Yep, nine.
and looking good across here and across here here is the nine now I had eights I believe in this two screen yes eight blocking down here so that's the eight then uh, hmm. okay so eight blocking across here puts eight into one of these two squares blocking up here eight will be here and the last number down here is a three I think uh, three across here and three in that square there. This is going to be a six. Um, do do do. What's left? What are we missing here? Two, five, and eight. Two, five, eight. One of each. Um, this. Across here, this, this is going to be two and eight, isn't it? So, no, no help on two or eight there. Okay. Uh, like I say, not quite there yet, but almost there. So, uh, I think I've got enough now. I can see that the two blocks this square, the eight blocks this square, and because three blocks up like this, three is going to be in either this square or this square, which is also going to block down here. So that means that two, eight, and three are in these squares here. In fact, we can say three blocking across like this and blocking across here. That is the three and the eight blocking here. So that's going to be the eight and the two is the last number down here and then this is going to be a five five blocking across both of these rows will put a five into there or I could just look at the end of the row I guess would be a better way to do it this is a oh no I was gonna say seven it's not gonna be a seven is it it's going to be a two isn't it and then the last number to get up here I think is an eight and uh, we are well on our way I'm quite confident of finishing this one off I think now uh, I think so, but we should never quite say <laughs> never say never. Um, let's see, what are we missing here? Two and five. No, can't get those yet. Uh, how are we doing up here? We are looking for six and eight. Eight, of course, yeah, because I said from earlier on, didn't I? So now we've got the intersecting eight here. We can see eight is there, six is there. Uh, okay, six across these two rows and a six up here. That's going to give us a six in that square there. Um, what else is missing up here? One, two, five, nine. So we've got the twos blocking across like this. So that's the room for the two. Two blocks down here. Here is the two. The last number here is a five, I believe. Five blocking up here and five across here. Puts a five into that square there. Five blocking all the way up here gives us a five there. And the last number to place across this row, I think, is a nine. Uh, we have also have nine blocking up here. So here is our nine and nine across here gives us a nine in that square. The missing number here is a three, three blocks across here. Here's the three. The last number to get here is a one and a one finishes Julian's game. Thank you. Really appreciate that, Julian. Great. You said it's a, I think you said it was an easy level, but I'm not sure that I, I would call that an easy level game. I would say at least a medium, more likely somewhere around the hard level, maybe somewhere between medium and hard something like that but a really enjoyable game i loved it thank you and uh, if anybody wants to submit um classic sudokus only please make them not uh so impossible that i can't do them there are <laughs> certain sudokus that i just can't deal with but uh you can put a, a pattern as julian did on the uh just ones and zeros um that I can paste into Sudoku Exchange, or you could send me a message on, I still got the Twitter account, I haven't quite deleted it yet, I'm still dithering about it, uh, Mastodon and um, the Facebook page, uh, you can search for the name of this channel in on any of those, and you'll come acro across me some on one of those three places, if you want to send a message to me, or send me a puzzle to try, I'll have a go as long as it's not one of those impossible games uh, <laughs> that I just can't solve. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, night, night, I'll say, because I'm not playing any more games today. I've got to go and look after the cat now. Bye-bye.